again, do not try this at home. Period. Alright, this is the one I've been waiting for the most. It is the H&N Hornet. It actually has a, what I believe to be brass point, I mean sharp point. I don't know if it'll be light enough to give it the velocity needed, but it definitely has the armament. Alright, that deal made it through in a pretty fresh part of the plate. And when it got into the block, it exploded. Unlike the other one that kept penetrating. Yeah, that one made a mess. It didn't make it very far, but that pellet just disintegrated. It made a nasty little wound. Yeah. Wow. I don't see the tip anywhere. I don't know. I'll have to probably take this plate apart later. Impressive. Alright, we're going to test the Gammo armor piercing one again. Just to make sure it wasn't a fluke and I didn't hit a weak spot on the plate. Uh, I'm going to try to hit somewhere that hasn't been hit. It looked like it might have came apart. So, yeah, it did. It came apart. The main body hit right there in the top. And I think the BB went through the bottom. And it still penetrated. There's your BB right there, even further than the last one. So it went down and came over half the block. And yeah, it's just a BB. So that one came apart and it's still penetrated. So obviously the BB is the key uh, to the penetration. Uh, pretty dang impressive, if you ask me. Alright, this one, I'm just going to do a bare gel test. This is a Barracuda Hunter by H&N. It's a decent size hollow point. So I just want to see what it would do to bare gel. <clears throat> And, yeah, it looks like it opened up. I can't tell. It didn't go very deep. Wow, it only went probably about six inches, maybe. It did definitely open up. All right, we're going to try the Crow Magnum by H&N versus the Bear Gel. I believe this one's designed to expand even quicker, so... Probably not much penetration, but we'll see. Alright, well. The skirt is right here. And the rest of the pellet is right there. So it came apart. Alright, well, as you can see, they're not designed for this. Don't try this at home. This little Marlin's just an old beater that I just put back together. It didn't even work. I got it for basically nothing. And uh, did a lot of gunsmithing to get it to run. You know, a little crack stock. Just an old beater. Uh, but anyway, I was willing to, to give it, come out here and give it a try. And like I said, they're not designed for this. This isn't a good idea. I mean, in a life or death situation, could it work? Yes. Uh... Did they perform better than I kind of expected? I thought they might penetrate the armor. Uh, the fact that they did, I think, is pretty, pretty awesome, honestly. So I can't really complain. Uh, out of all those shots, three penetrated. Uh, the two pellets that went through both had something in common. They both had solid metal tips, one with a BB and one with a sharpened point. Uh, so obviously, that's what you need. For penetration of body armor well I'm gonna try one more on the bear gel I'm gonna try that Winchester maximum velocity just because I'm curious I also want to say that this gun is full of fouling I mean I'm talking this barrel is gonna be a real pain to clean because these are not made to be shot like this and they're shearing and leaving pieces of uh, different alloys and copper and uh, lead throughout this barrel and yeah I'm gonna have a real fun time plus these nail gun blanks I'm sure are pretty 
pretty nasty themselves so that's just another warning this is not good for your gun and potentially dangerous <clears throat> Let's see what we got here. Wow, it hit right on top of that other one, but it uh, looks like it left a pretty decent wound cavity from about there to there, and then continued on and stopped right there, kind of did a downward arc. It appears to be slightly mushroomed, and I would say it went halfway through this 16-inch uh, block. So, there you go. On to bigger and better things. Alright, just for uh, grins, I'm going to go ahead and shoot the H&N Hornet that went through the body armor in the 22 caliber rifle test. I'm going to go ahead and shoot it out of this BB gun, see if it will penetrate. <clears throat> I'm doubting it. And... It definitely did not penetrate or even come close. So, there you have it.